It's 10 trivia questions on the Bechtel test, where you have to see if a movie passes a certain type of test. This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show. Today's episode all about the Bechdel test. Here is what the Bechdel test is. It has to have at least two women in the movie who talk to each other about something besides a man. So those are the three stipulations here. A lot of movies do not pass this test. Uh, believe it or not. So uh, we've got some fun ones here for you from Robert Casey. Before we get into today's episode, I want to give a shout out to one of our Patreon subscribers, Simon Time of the Simon Time Trivia Show in the Orlando, Florida area. My bu- good buddy, Simon, runs a lot of great live shows there. He does virtual shows, and he was the one who inspired me to do virtual trivia when the pandemic first hit. So look up Simon Time Trivia. He's a fantastic trivia host. He's a pro wrestler and all-around good guy. That's Simon Time Trivia. Thanks for the support, buddy. Um, We have a couple of preview questions here, too, before we get into the meat of the episode. These are from the Weakest Link Trivia Board Game at Home Edition from 2004, 2003, somewhere around there. Here's a couple questions for you. In the poem, what German town was cleared of rats by the Pied Piper? What town in Germany was rid of rats by the Pied Piper? The answer was Hamlin. Hamlin. Your next warm-up question, Fandango is a traditional dance of which country? Fandango is a traditional dance of which country? That is Spain. Spain. And your last little warm-up question here, what camera introduced by Eastman Kodak in 1900 originally sold for $1? That was the Brownie. Brownie. So just some fun extra questions for you. And now we're going to dive into this episode on the Bechdel movie test. Here we go. All right, it's the Bechdel test. You just have to say if this movie passes or does not pass the Bechdel test. And the Bechdel test is it has to have at least two women in the movie who talk to each other about something besides a man. Here's number one, Downton Abbey, the movie from 2019. Downton Abbey, number one. Number two, Black Panther. Number two, Black Panther. Number three, the Lego Batman movie. The Lego Batman movie. Number four, from 2009, Star Trek. 2009's Star Trek. Number five, Finding Nemo. Finding Nemo. Number five. Number six, The Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring. Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring. Number seven, The Big Lebowski. From 1998, The Big Lebowski. Number eight, Fargo, from 96, Fargo. Number nine, Toy Story, Toy Story, the original. And number 10, Die Hard, from 1988, number 10, Die Hard. You just had to put pass or fail for the Bechtel test. Hope you got them all right. We'll talk about it in a Sound effect. We are back with the answers to the Bechdel test. Let's see what you got right and wrong on this quick quiz from Robert Casey. Number one, Downton Abbey. Does it have two women in it? Yes. Who talk to each other? Yes. About something besides a man? Yes. That one does pass. Downton Abbey, the movie, passes. Number two, Black Panther passes as well. Number two, Black Panther is a pass in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Number three, the Lego Batman movie from 2017 is a pass. That's right. It does pass the Bechdel test. Star Trek from 09 with Chris Pine and the whole gang 
passes. Yes, that is a pass as well. Number six, one, two, three, four. No, number five, Finding Nemo does not pass the Bechdel test, if you can believe it. Uh, not a lot of female characters in there, especially who are talking to each other. So that is Finding Nemo, a fail for the Bechdel test. Number six is uh, Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring, and that also does not pass. You shall not pass Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring. 2001 does not pass. 1998's Big Lebowski does not pass. There's three in a row that do not pass Big Lebowski. I mean, the main character is the dude, uh, so go figure there. Not a lot of female characters talking to each other in that movie. And we had Fargo, 96, does not pass, does not pass. And uh, that one seems tough because there's a lot of characters in there, but there must not be a lot of conversations about uh, characters who are not male. So there you go. Fargo does not pass. Toy Story does not pass. Look at this. We have all these in a row who do not pass. Toy Story from 1995 does not pass the Bechdel test. And then number 10, Die Hard 1988 does pass the Bechdel test test there you have it hope that was fun and enlightening for you you can go try and find more movies that pass or fail that bechdel test and you can google b-e-c-h-d-e-l test and find probably a big big list of those thanks to robert casey for those questions i had never heard of that before and we have a fact of the day for you the fact is that corn is grown on every continent except antarctica corn is grown everywhere except in the frozen tundra of antarctica Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend, and we'll see you next time for more trivia with Buds. Cheers! Cheers.